Hi, what's up YouTube? Um, I'm here, it is Monday now. Uh, it is really early. Came here to Chick-fil-A to make sure I edit the next video. Uh, to be honest, I didn't have no time at all to record anything this entire weekend other than Saturday. So I do apologize about that. Getting back into it, so I'm here, work a new video, and get back to work right after this. So, see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> all right YouTube, so I'm leaving the office right now. Gotta go somewhere, I'm actually kinda late. But uh, yeah, today was a kinda busy day. Um, worked on the same projects as yesterday, as as Friday, but what I got to do is make sure there are no bugs and that's the thing about coding is that when you do program and when you work in the office um, where you work with so many clients, the most important thing is that before you ship it, there are no bugs and because this client that I'm working with is kind of big, I had to make sure I took care of all the, blug, the bugs, all the bugs before we even gave it to them in the first place. So I'm taking care of that right now. Good morning YouTube, what's up everyone? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry I actually did not vlog at all last night or yesterday at all after work. Sorry guys, life happens. Anyway, I'm at somewhere really, really special right now. I'm here at Lee Sandwiches and like I was gonna study and work on some stuff at Denny's down over here. Um, but I saw this Lee Sandwiches and I figured I should go inside and the moment I came inside this place, like, you know, like, smell activates so many memories, and all these memories came back. The moment I stepped into these sandwiches, looking at the menu, brought back all these memories, and you know, I'm on, a, I'm kind of on a diet, and but then I bought all these things I used to get at these sandwiches, and this was years ago, like, four years ago. And so I, you know, and I just want to show you what I got because all these good memories came back. So right now, here at Lee Sandwiches, I got the mocha smoothie with this cool music, you know. Uh, uh oh, I got chicken egg roll. Chicken egg roll, how can you not get egg rolls if you go to a Vietnamese restaurant? I got fried chicken. But this is what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna actually study the Bible here. Um, and then, gotta go to work. 6 a.m., morning Bible study hustle. <laughs> See you guys in a little bit. This music's pretty good actually. Oh man. Oh. Alright, what's up YouTube? So, I'm leaving these sandwiches right now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty, I'm pretty exhausted. Look at that. These sandwiches now open. But yeah, got a lot of studying done. Gotta make sure I make time to study the Bible. What the heck is that? Check this out guys. What is that? Weird. What kind of bug is that? Anyway, if anyone knows what kind of bug that is, let me know. I'm gonna take a short nap before work, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Good morning, you too. What's up, everyone? <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. I tried vlogging Monday. I tried vlogging Tuesday. I mean, I did a little bit here and there, and I wasn't really be able. I haven't been able to do it because it's just uh, honestly, it's been really hard, like making time. And there have been days when I kind of, you know, how you have writer's block. Sometimes I feel like I'm like having like a vlogging block. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, but anyway, it's early in the morning. It is now Wednesday. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I need to study a little bit more of the Bible at the coffee shop, get some coffee. Uh, but you know what? Let's go ahead and begin this day with some drone shots. You guys ready? See you after. Good morning, YouTube. What's up, everyone? Now, it's Wednesday. <laughs> I've been trying to vlog the last couple days. Number one, it's been really hard due to time. On Secondly, I've kind of had like a vlogger's block. You know how you have like writer's block? I kind of had that for vlogging right now. Um, and, you know, I pretty much do the same thing at work every day as a coder. I don't do really too many different things now. I'm working on multiple projects. Um, you know, I guess something I could talk about is that, you know, at work we had a meeting. I'm not going to talk about what we talked about in the meeting, really, because um, that stuff is for work only. Um, but one thing they told me is that now they really want me to focus more on back end, which is really exciting. I'm really excited because like, I love coding so much and honestly I'm extremely efficient 
in front end development. I get things done quickly. I know how to do things very well in the front end aspect, especially within the niche that we're in within this industry. I can get things done quickly. I know how to make pages look nice and get them done as quick as possible. I can, because I've done so many different custom requests with many different clients, I know how to get those things done now. And so we had a meeting today and one thing to emphasize a lot is that Chris, you know what? Um, we, and the plan is to have our other junior developer who's primarily a back-end developer who's learning front-end development. I'm a friend I'm a front-end developer learning back-end development. Now what the plan is that we're kind of gonna switch it up where um, or he's gonna take in my take on my front end projects, a, a few of them, so I can focus more on back end, which is really exciting because even my technical director knows, like, you know, he even he got my back and he was like, you know what, Chris really wants to learn back end. He really wants to learn PHP and be well at it. It's just to be honest, with my and my job where I'm really the main front-end developer where I take on most of the requests and now all the clients know me as a front-end developer at work, they now email me, they contact me directly. Some of them have my number, <laughs> you know, so it's really prevented me and slowed my, my growth, um, you know, in the back-end aspect. Now, I've been learning Ruby on Rails and Ruby and the command line with the bootcamp. Um, and I haven't been able to post that video. They've been honestly really understanding and, um, you know, but the goal is I'm gonna, I'm actually pretty much done. And so that video is gonna come out this weekend on Saturday or Sunday. So look out for that. Um, other than that, everything's been good. Uh, I just been really putting a lot of focus and making sure I'm into scriptures more than anything, more than ever, now more than ever. Um, the word is so important to me. You know, and I make sure that I really know the Bible world, that I'm always deep in praying every morning, uh, making sure that God's number one. Number two is work, number three is YouTube, right? So. Unless I go full-time YouTube, maybe YouTube will be number two, <laughs> all right? But to be honest, I just love coding that much. But yeah, you know what? Post in the comment below. I, I can't necessarily show you my code at work. Um, now, I can create my own code, and I can make time, like 10, 20 minutes here and there just to record when I'm coding. I could do that. Uh, but put, go ahead and post in the comment below what you guys want to see in my vlogs. Now, of course, people want to see code. What do you want me to talk about? Um, Please, if you never post a comment, make sure you post a comment today. And if you haven't, please make sure you like the video too. That would help a lot. I would love that so much and I'm very thankful for that. But please let me know what you guys want me to talk about. There are people, there are literally thousands of people who watch my channel who have not commented yet. I see the same people comment all the time and I'm thankful for that. I'm not lying, I like that. But I wanna see more people comment and let me know what you want. I wanna interact with you. Um, and you know what, uh, one last thing. Someone messaged me on Twitter last night and said, Chris, I thought you, you know, I thought you were real. Why aren't you responding to my Twitter messages? I messaged you last week, you didn't respond. I hope you're not like other YouTubers out there who are fake. And for me, I'm like, I read it and I'm not gonna respond to that. <laughs> Like, why would I respond to that message? You're trying to force my hand to respond to you. Um, you have to understand, I, I literally received emails, so many emails on emails, messages on Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram, and I have a full-time job, and I have a life, and I vlog, and I edit videos, and I learn code outside of work. I don't have the time to respond to all of that all the time, only when I get the chance, usually when I'm on the toilet, just kidding. <laughs> so, yeah, don't say that. Anyway, I gotta go. Gonna get some coffee with some friends, and I'll see you guys after. Peace. Meetup. Yesterday was the biggest meetup. Yesterday. I don't know. September and they think it's going on. Are you currently recording that right now? Sorry? No, I'm not. <laughs> the last time someone tried filming and our supervisor started. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, man. What is up, YouTube? Um, so, I just went, I went to lunch break. Went to Whole Foods with Tony. Um, yeah, they actually told me that I couldn't vlog inside, so I couldn't really talk much in there. Went back to work. This one project that I've been working on since last night um, has finally been completed. And it wasn't a hard page, but it's a page I had a lot of custom, and I needed to do a lot of custom, like hard code, custom code into the page um, for a really, really big client. Um, and actually, this is code I've used before, um, but I hard coded it. I didn't copy any code. I just wrote it from scratch. Um, I'll probably show it the code to you later but um man guys i really feel like uh, my eyes are about to like fall off <laughs> i don't know it's because um 
like today's I know it's a little windy sorry guys I, today's a little different than other days because um, uh, you know I was so focused on getting this really big project done and I did um, it's one of the days when time just flies by so fast like really really fast um, because I was so focused I didn't even realize it was 1 p.m. and Tony's like dude do you want to go to lunch I'm like wait what do you mean lunch oh shoot it's already 1 I didn't even have music on I was just literally just coding non-stop man my eyes are tired man my eyes are really tired um, to the point that I just kept scratching it and I'm like and I just told Tony right after I finished the project I'm like Tony I'm sorry man but uh, I'm gonna have to go on a break and so here I am right now one of those days Alright, you probably can't even hear me right now because it's so windy, so I'm going to go back to work. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Peace. What is up, YouTube? Okay. I got off work. 5 p.m. Um, had to work on some stuff on my computer. It's about 5.40 now. Um, yeah, now, I wonder, now I know why my eyes were hurting. Yes, I was coding and I was really focused all day. But dang, I think I'm sick. Uh, this can't happen. I cannot. I cannot be sick, guys. I, uh, I think I have the flu because, as you can tell, I have a runny nose right now. My head is light. My I feel very lightheaded. I feel. I don't feel good. So. I think I might have to work from home tomorrow. I'm gonna ask him and ask him tonight. But I wanna see how I feel later tonight. I'm gonna try to get some rest right now and see how I feel tonight. If not, I'll just have to um, call in to work tomorrow. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. I'm gonna go. I'm really sick. And I'm gonna end it right here. All right, guys. See you later. <laughs> Sorry, the vlog isn't good enough today. One of those days. But, man. <sighs> See you guys later. Peace.